We're here at Mayaka River State Park on the Canopy Walkway. You're in for a great adventure. We're going to see a side of the Florida forest that nobody gets to see, up in the tops of the trees. Gazing down on the tops of the palms, pines, and oak trees, the forest looks like a monstrous vegetable field. Little was known about the upper stories of our local forests, also known as the high frontier, until Dr. Margaret Lohman of Sarasota's Marie Selby Botanical Gardens suggested building the 85-foot-long walkway through the treetops. A researcher who spent time in the tropical rainforest, Lohman envisioned the walkway as a way to teach people about this fragile ecosystem. So with me is Ranger Dave Harshbarger. This must be a great place to work. You can climb up here every day, and what a view. We're not even up at the top yet. Yes, sir. Yeah, this is one of the most popular attractions out here, our Canopy Walkway. Uh, it gives you a great view of the canopy, uh, especially when you hit the top of the tower, you can see the majority of the property. Now, when we get up top, how high will we be? You'll end up just, uh, just at 74 feet. Now, tell me, this is a whole different world up here. It seems like there's all different kinds of animals. You don't really get this view of the forest unless you're up in the treetops. That's right. Um, a lot of the different uh, mosses and things that grow in the trees, you get a pretty nice up close and personal view of them. You'll see the squirrels come right by you. We've had bobcats walk along up here. Uh, it, it's pretty neat up top. Amateur botanists love the state's park's canopy walkway because it offers a chance to view epiphytes or air plants at eye level. Most Florida school children learn about Spanish moss at an early age. According to legend, this long, stringy epiphyte received its name because it resembled the beards favored by the conquistadores. Now, tell me a little bit about the history of this structure. I mean, why was it built? Uh, originally built um, just to get some awareness. Uh, the treetops, a lot of the research that goes on with it comes out of the rainforest. Um, North America did not have anything like this around. So this is the first one built in North America, completed in 2000. Um, it, it's really brought a lot of visitors to the park. A lot of people are interested in coming to see it. Boy, that was quite a climb, more than 100 steps. But I tell you, it's worth it. You get up here, you can see things for miles. Until next time, I'm Terry Tomlin with your everyday adventure at Mayaka River State Park.